Let's one of us go in there. I still fancy... Oh, God. Oh, ow. Ow, ow. Oh. <laughs> get up. Get up. Get down there. Okay. There you go, Berserk and everything. Uh, you run down here, you run down I'll here. Go kill. Uh, activate that. Yeah, yeah, that's that. Um, heal Shale. Poor Shale. Healer. Uh -huh. That's it. Prepare. Run. So yeah, two at once, but I've got him trapped in the door. So, that's pretty sweet. That's nice. Do that. Let's back away a little bit, because you're not... Be crushed. That was a mistake. Uh -huh. Now we're through. It's hitting Liliana as well. Bad Shale. Uh, we need to heal. It's nice. Okay, still to yeah, attack one at a time, one at a time, guys. Try and ignore the other one. I know it's kind of difficult because they're like all evil and stuff, quite big and hard hitting. Just ignore the other one. Are you done? Okay, that one's almost dead. Yeah. Should be fine now. Yes, hit him. Mind you, he's not immune to damage. So let's heal him. Which is, you know, which is the pity. But yeah. Keep attacking, Barak. Keep attacking. Keep attacking. There we go. Thank you for your loots. Yeah. I just, I just dropped one of those. Should we send him in? He can't get knocked down and stuff. Do, 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 do. Ah! What was that? What did that do? Oh, that! Throw rocks at me! Oh, ow! I mean, it did hurt, but it didn't really disable him. Let's give him a heal, shall we, eh? Let's give him a heal. Go kill. Go kill right. Right. Uh, I'm not liking this that much, honestly. I'll just take care of that one. It shouldn't be too bad, I'm hoping, Saving maybe. The day. Right. Yes. Yeah, that extra heal there was a little bit too, uh... Overboard, I think. Give him a slap, Shell. What's that smell? Keep going on that one. Here comes trouble. Blocked. Oh. Ah. <laughs> yeah, we're doing fine. That one's dead. This one. Yep. And, I tried to be uh, merciful. Ogren's doing just fine, and even uh, yeah, the heal there works pretty good. Shale, just don't order me. Oh, I am. Right, I'm game. Okay. So I'm wondering if I move Liliana in here, will these traps not go off? I saw it doesn't make sense because you know she disarms traps and stuff. But if I'm wrong, and that doesn't happen. Thank you. Um, she'll be trapped in there, sort of like, you know, and not in a great position. Great. Sure thing. Well, have I already got one? Have I already got one? I have. I know I can drop Ameth Amethyst now, though, because they're basically worthless. And can I get through here now? I can. It's all clear, guys. Come on. You did something there, didn't you? That wasn't too bad. I don't see any demons attacking me, golems and stuff. Alright, good. Pass that one. Long way to go. Fine. I know. 
All right. <laughs> I didn't save the game there. I didn't save the game. Oh, this is different. Hmm. Pretty. But, um... Why? Oh. That's not good. Uh, that is... What is that? What am I looking at? What am I looking at? I see a, a red thing on the map. Uh, what are you doing? Forgotten spirits. Okay. Uh, forgotten spirit. Forgotten spirits. Oh, shit. Feel free to attack them, yes. But, uh... What's that smell? Missing. Oh, no. ah, missing. This one. Hmm. Once I get them on my um, journal up there, my vestry, if you like. Are you still doing strong. Yeah, stop that. Oh, he's not. It's me. Go on, damage. Yeah. Hurry up and kill that one. There we go. So you're all like shield wally. Make his breath. Alistair sort of style, huh? Away, run away, run away, run away. Slow. Okay. I think fire gas. Spirit Anvil. Moving on. Oh, that! Oh, that hurt. All right, nice. Enraged Spirit. I see. We're gonna go through uh, several um, sort of sets of enemies. Like a gauntlet thing. Not it. Kill, 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 kill. Yes. Yep. Sort of swap round here. Stand still. This is gonna hit us wherever we stand, so not all I can do about that. That will stop me. Have at you then. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? You don't like that at all. So when I, when I can click on that, I will. And of course, because she clicks on it, they're all alive. Uh, where do I go? No. Yep, yeah, okay. Do whatever you're doing. Ah! <laughs> oh, Saving no. the day. You get down here as well. Everyone just attack him. On my way. You will be stopped. Ow! What the hell was that? Pulled me back there? I didn't even know what happened there, but he's, he's... Ow. I don't know what the hell happened there. Hmm, not too happy about that, because now I've lost my healer. No. I do have healing potions, I know, I know I have healing potions. I'm still, my main character. Yeah, see, boom. Spits flying up there and stuff. Take your healing potions. They are good for you. you know, every time I kill one of these, that come becomes available. No, not everyone. Although, I'm destroying its faces, aren't I? Hmm. Ready. So we still have. That's two faces down, two to go, and currently I'm managing it all right. On it. Leave her alone. Fire that shot. Now run away, run away, run away. Here comes Arthur. 
And now suddenly, shield pummel. Well, when you're out of that, do that. Good. Don't miss. Stop missing. Oh, good. This won't feel good. Nice. Get that. Actually, you get. Oh, okay. Hang on. Uh, greater, potent. Where are just the regular ones for you? You have that. You have that. You go and hit that. Yeah. Semi risky, but. It's done. That's your eyes put out. Uh, come back if down here, must. guys. <laughs> Please, guys. Yep. Yeah, it's this one. Oh. We're gonna fight up there. Yeah, not happy with Liliana. Not happy. I'll do it. She does loads of damage. Here and comes that trouble. One dead. Go get that one. Defend yourself. Don't try to be. Oh. Merciful. That it or one more? Oh, no, that's it. That's it. We got it. No. I don't think it's over yes, just yet. Of course. Sure thing. No, it isn't. Hmm. As you like. Well, they're enraged. They're not happy. They're not doing that much damage to us. We're doing quite a lot to them, so I quite like that. You'll be a fine red mist when I'm done you. Down you go. Oh, take that. Oh. Just don't. Oh really? It's gonna last that me. long? I didn't realize there was some over there as well. What if we hit them all at the same time? I can't now because uh, Good to go. I have a player down, but I think I know what Lovely I have to do here. <laughs> It must. Hmm. All right. Leave him alone. Oh, scream for mercy. Move. So that one's on. Now. I'm gonna leave it because maybe we'll get. Now that one's on. I hit three at the same time. I can't hit four, but I can hit three. I'm running out of health pulses. Ow. Time. I see, only two come there and they're on. Alright. To end their pathetic little existences. Could you just farm XP here again as well? I'm just thinking. Yeah. If you prepare specifically. Uh. Leave her alone! Uh. <laughs> oh god. Uh. Uh. Well now there's no point, is it? Well, I don't know, maybe Sorry. I can hit them. Quickly enough, or get them all glowing. Get them all glowing. Uh, potent then, and you just have a crater. So yeah, you're both fine, but this is going to be really costly in uh, health poultices. I'll bite off your arm. He's going to bite off your arm. Just don't order me. Don't be near that. All right. Oh, I'm doing the right thing. Hmm. 
Again, losing my mage when he's suddenly there really just didn't help us at all. Make sure I haven't got any others that are hiding. Nope, no I don't. I've got the two greater ones and that's it. I'm going to have to use one now. Speed things up slightly. Okay, they're all on. So if I kill this thing... Not happy, is it? Not doing it. Okay, hang on. You hit that. You hit that. Oh, they've gone. Although, that... Something happened there. Is that it? That is it. Okay, nice. I'm not quite sure what happened there. But yeah. Combination of the anvils hitting it and stuff, and uh, I'm not sure we had to hit it on all sides or something. Probably could have uh, handled that better if I knew what the hell I was doing. Hmm. Have you got a broken bone now? Where's your other injuries? Probably the dexterity doesn't really matter so much. All right. Well. We did it, although now we have no uh, healing potions left, and uh, we don't really have that many lyrium potions either. Though there are veins around, so I'll use that to my advantage if I can in future areas. Hmm. Does the path split? No, it does not. Well, I see you, Rubble. Yes, there you are. Hiding there. It was something useful. Ten million... Oh. Not ten million healing potions, sadly, sadly, but, you know. I didn't do that. Why would you say... Oh, God. Oh dear. More of these. My name is Caribou. Once, longer ago than I care to think. I was a paragon to the dwarves of Orzammar. Caradon, the paragon smith, alive? Ah, there is a voice I recognize. Hmm. Shell of the House of Kadash, step forward. You know my name. Is it you that forged me then? Is it you that gave me my name? Have you forgotten then? It has been so long. I made you into the Golem you are now, Shale. But before that you were a dwarf, just as I was. The finest warrior to serve King Valtor, and the only woman to volunteer. The only woman? Hmm. A dwarf? I laid you on the anvil of the Void here in this very room, and put you into the form you now possess. The anvil of the Void? That is what we seek. If you seek the anvil, then you must care about my story, or be doomed to relive it. Ah. Uh. So, you made the anvil. I mean, I do know this, but I'm going to humor him anyway. Though I made many things in my time, I rose to fame and earned my status based on a single item. The anvil of the void. It allowed me to forge a man of steel or stone, as flexible and clever as any soldier. As an army, they were invincible, but I told no one the cost. No mere smith, however skilled, has the power to create life. To make my golems live, I had to take their lives from elsewhere. Um, the voice actor sounds a little bit like the guy who did Saravok. In Baldur's Gate 1, 2, Thunderball. I'm not sure whether it is. 
you know, because he's, you know, behind the metal mask and everything, which is an effect that's very well done. But I, I want to believe that it's him. So, um, was it worth it taking all those lives? Although that seems more like my um, character's thing. Sounds like blood magic. A danger it is a dangerous road for sure. The darkspawn were pressing in. Originally, I only took volunteers, the bravest of souls, willing to trade their very lives for the chance to defend their homeland. Originally. But King Valtor became greedy. He began to force men, castless and criminals, his political enemies, all of them were to be given to the anvil. It took feeling the hammer's blow myself to realize the height of my crimes. Hmm. Not much of a dwarf, are you? Like 20 feet tall. Osmo, I could really use it now, you know. Saying. No! I entombed myself here to find a way to destroy the anvil. It must not be used again! No! The anvil is mine! No one will take it from me! Shale, you fought to destroy the anvil once. Do not allow it to fall into unthinking hands again! You speak of things I do not remember. You say we fought. Did you use our control rods to command us to do so? I destroyed the rods. Perhaps my apprentices eventually learned to replace the rods. I do not know. But if so, then all they need is the anvil to make all the slaves they need. You, please, help me destroy the anvil. Do not let it enslave more souls than it already has. Oof. Now I, I see where this is going. I have to find one side or the other. I am really heading towards... Yeah, I mean, it, it's up, you know, it's really heading towards sort of like, I'm making a decision before I know I know I have to make it, but um, I want to talk through this. It's really leading towards sort of like um, his side of the story. You know, forcing people to become golems, effectively slaves for uh, the rest of their lives, well, all eternity, really. You might as well be turning them in, into uh, zombies or something, pretty much. You know, that's what that's basically what you're doing, controlling them with control rods and, you know, effectively magic and stuff. Um, so, you know, and, and Brank is all like power hungry and stuff and she demands to use it, but it's using it to fight the Darkspawn, which could well save your entire existence. Save Ozamar, save the Dwarves, and the Blight and stuff. So it's difficult, um, but I'll cross that road when I come to it, which I imagine might be quite soon. But I like it. Um, you're Paragon, I'll help you if you support a new king. Branka, I won't, uh, I need to bang I won't make golems here, but Branka would. Why should I let your guilt inconvenience me? I can understand his guilt, so I'm not going to say that. So I'm going to go down this row of, I can buy, I need to bag with Branka, I won't make golems, but you know, then she will, and sort of thing. But I, I do sort of like need the anvil. I'm going to press that, you know, we, we need it to fight, you know, to for my, for my aims. As long as the anvil exists, it may be used to create slaves, and it will be used. Why seek a more difficult path when another, easier path is available? Help me destroy it! See, so Branka can use it to help me against the Blight. That's what it comes down to. Branka can use it to help me against the Blight if we have an army of golems made from basically the castless. Or, if you're a paragon, I'd help you. Um, if you're a paragon, you are a paragon. I'll help you if you spot a new king. So I can go either way. You know, either way, I'll get the dwarves on my side. Just depends whether I want the golems with me as well. Maybe Shale will have something to do. And I noticed that. I think Shale is spelt differently when he says it. Let's go to the middle of the road for now. I suppose you would know the risk, of all people. So it fights with Caradin. Good. That seems right. Thank you, stranger. Your compassion shames me. No! You will not take it! Not while I still live! Bronca, don't throw your life away for this! Hmm. I completely forgot about him. 
<laughs> completely. Because, although she has hardly indeed himself, herself to her husband, um, and he doesn't really, you know, he's not really like fixed to her anymore. We're well, not fixed, as, you know, not really the right word, but um, she does. He, he's not obviously liking what she's sort of become. She's not the Branca you knew. Can you see she's dangerous? We have to destroy the Anvil Branca. So I can talk straight to Branca. Uh, so I've decided now, unwittingly decided to go um, join Caradin in destroying the Anvil that we came to find. Well, actually, we came to find Branca. There was no mention from the Dwarves of finding the Anvil and creating Golems. They all thought it was completely destroyed. And if they know that, then... You know, they, they, you know, they, they, they assume it's destroyed. So us, us actually destroying it, or lost forever, and us destroying it won't affect our standing with them. Um, and they also expect Branka to be dead. So uh, if we say, yeah, we well, Branka was dead, but we found Caradin, and he'll support us. You know, that works. And he looks like he's, you know, pretty neat in a fight. You know, I got to say, I mean, look, look at him. So, and. Yeah, look, she's dangerous. I mean, look at her. She's obsessed. Just give her the blasted thing. She's confused. Maybe once she calms down, we can talk to her. <laughs> wow. See, so, you now I say, all right, so now I can decide to go, you know, with Branka's idea of using that. Which will probably make the, uh, the final fight, however that's going to work, with the Darkspawn a little easier, having golems on your side. Um, despite the fact that they're, you know, es essentially I'm going to use, you know, the term zombie to simplify it. That's essentially sort of what they are, you know. But you're making people into zombies to fight for you. And I don't think that's particularly what my character wants to do. Um, so I'm not going to go with that. It's not a risk I'm willing to take. Oh, she's obsessed beyond... Re I don't want to say, like, beyond redemption, but I'm going to point out... I don't want to make my character say beyond redemption but I'm gonna say look she's completely obsessed with it um it's not healthy bah! you're not the only master smith here Caradin oh boy golems obey me attack a control roll but my friend you must help me I cannot stop her alone and I guess we will pause the Ogren disapproves, as you may well expect, because we're going against his wife. She's obsessed, by the way. However, oh, but Liliana, yeah, Shale's different. Shale, different spelling. 